Hi, my name is Christine Fry, and this is my Kearney High School DMD Identity Project 2015. My identity project is made up of six places that shaped me. These six places tell the story of my life. The best place to start would be my room. My room is a place of comfort and it has shaped me because I can say or do whatever I need to and I know that nobody will judge me for it. The picture of my stuffed animal shows the vibe of comfort that I always get when I enter my room. It was in the comfort of my room that I made a video for my friends and family, opening up to them about my life. Hi, my name is Christine. I'm 13 years old and I have depression and mental psychosis. It was in my room when I made that video that I accepted who I am and all of my imperfections. My next place of identity is the music room in my house. The music room is my place to cope. I listen to music there. I play guitar in this room. And I do these things as coping skills of mine to help me stay on the road of recovery. These are some pictures of musical equipment I have for recording. And this is a picture of my keyboard. The music room has shaped me because it's a place I can go to and just purely be me. The pick in this picture is the very first pick I used playing the guitar. This room reminds me of all the progress I've made. My third place of identity is an organization's office. The organization is called Kickstart. Kickstart helps teens and young adults who are struggling with mental health issues. Kickstart has shaped me because the workers there have helped turn me into a strong advocate that never gives up. For people like me, Kickstart is a place that saves lives. We are provided with a list of family guidelines, which are shown in the picture, so that the whole family can be recognized and helped in their own ways. The next place of my identity belongs to a school called St. Columba. St. Columba is a pre-K through 8th grade private school. This picture shows the church that is attached to the school. I entered St. Columba when I was 3 years old. These are some yearbook photos of my classes. I made amazing friends at St. Columba that you can see in the pictures. St. Columba definitely shaped me, considering I spent pre-K through 7th grade there. But it was when I entered my final year at St. Columba, the 8th grade, 
that I began to understand not everybody is accepting of people's differences. I was not allowed to attend school there because of my mental disorder. As much as I've been shaped badly recently at St. Columba, I will always keep with me all the good. St. Columba gave me the hope of a new beginning ahead. My new beginning started with Holy Family Church. Holy Family has shaped me because it's my new place of worship and faith. These pictures are of the outside and inside of the church, as well as a prayer book. Here are a few words from my friend Memo talking about Holy Family. I first met Christina when uh, I went to a meeting at my church and I learned that we were going to be um, getting a new student. And so I was excited to, to meet this person that I've heard much about. And when I first met Christine, um, I knew right off the bat that she was going to be a, um, a great person. She was uh, really like, kind and when uh, I heard her speak, she was very like, she was very kind, she was very, um, she wasn't very brash. And that's what I liked about her is that she was very like open. She was open to us talking to her and being around her. And then um, afterwards, I learned that she was gonna be going to Kearney. She was gonna be going to the DMD. And I was excited because I was gonna be able to help her out with any videos that she needed. And, um, and I think that's, how we met. Holy Family is a church in Linda Vista and that's a place where people can feel welcome. It's more of, it's not just a church, it's a community um, of a bunch of different cultures. We have Vietnamese, we have Hispanic, um, it's just a different variety of people and it's a place where people can feel welcome and feel encouraged to just ex uh, express and share their faith with people that are um, always having an open arm to anyone that would want to come and visit. My sixth and final place of identity is Kearney High School. Kearney gave me my official new start and it has shaped me to think about the past and leave it behind. My whole family, my mom, dad, my brother James, and even her dog Sparky all believe Kearney is the best school for me. And I agree. Whether it's going to football games or meeting some friends, I know I love Kearney already. I may have lost a good home, but now I have gained a great one. So for now, Kearney concludes my identity, and I'm looking forward to the future. And that's my identity project.